I talked to Dr. Islam, I met him my junior year of high school at the Little Balsa Wood Bridge competition. And so I got to talking to him and he was like, you should really come to YSU, you would be a great asset, I would love to have you on our program. And, and like just feeling that community, like oh my gosh, this, this guy wants me at his school. It was, it was really cool to build that relationship with him. Our students get real exposure to the real world engineering by doing the labs. There are six different laboratories we have and the machines in the laboratory, the equipment we have, is very good compared to other state universities. Most people just think of building bridges and roads and buildings, but there is a geotechnical side, which is basically the foundations of all the buildings and bridges. The environmental aspect, which is uh, how can we design things to make them more environmentally safe. Our students are getting jobs as soon as they graduate. They usually work for different consulting companies around this area. They also go to the uh, public sectors like Ohio Department of Transportation, Pennsylvania Department of Transportation. Our students are also involved with uh, Engineers Without Borders. The past three summers I went to three different countries. I went to Panama, then I went to Australia, and then this past summer I went to Ecuador. We laid the foundation for a building, so knowing like how deep I had to make the base of the building to make sure that it wasn't going to fall over and knowing what concrete's supposed to actually look like because most people are just like, oh yeah, that's concrete, but actually knowing what it's supposed to look like in the texture and, and like how long it's, it takes to actually harden. I learned that in all of my classes, like strengths of materials and, and doing the hands-on with the concrete canoe. Once they come here, they know that they can have a good career a successful career and that's why they come. Knowing that the school that's 15 minutes from my house is actually a top ranked school here for STEM. People are recognizing that. So that kind of drew me here.